belongs to domains. So I created an alphanumeric domain and attached it to a new attribute in work order application. This domain has three values here that I want to add conditions for those values to be shown in the domain. So let's go to the domains application and bring up my alphanumeric domain that I call it condition. I have three values here and I'm gonna select my first value, click the view and modify conditions button. I'm gonna move to the condition expression manager application here and create a new condition for this value. In this condition I'm gonna say that I want this value to be shown when the work type is call. So I'm gonna save it and return with this new condition to my domain. I wanna say that this condition will work for the work order object which is the object where my con my domain is attached. Now let's move to my second value here. I'm gonna create a new condition to the second value and in this new condition I wanna say that the value will be available when the supervisor of the work order is Leandro. Now let's return to the domains with the new condition and the same here the object is work order. Now let's add the condition to the third value of the of an American domain. I want a different condition as well and in this condition I want to say that the value will be available when the work order has a phone number so phone number is not new let's save it and return with this condition to my third value of the domain as well the same object work order Let's click OK and notice that there are there is a different icon here so it shows that there is um, a condition attached to the values. Now let's see that in, in the work order application now the three values are hidden so because the condition does not match so let's Let's see the condition matching now. Work type call. We see the first value. Now, if I set the supervisor to Leandro, I see my second value in the domain. And now to show the third value, I have to type something to the phone attribute of the work order. Now, let's see. And the third value is shown. Now the three conditions matches and the three values are available. So that's all for today guys. Thank you and bye bye.